I had been in countries all over the world. I studied in Taiwan, in Russia, and different places. But never in my life have I been in any country that respected me as much as an American and even as a Christian as Saudi Arabia. Wow. SubhanAllah. So in the manners of Islam even in our daily lives. Well, yeah. finally, I walked to the mosque and I knocked on the door and I said, my name is Sam. I'm a Christian from the United States. Is it okay if I come inside? And the Muaddin, Shafiq Zawir, he hugged me wow. and he said, please come in. And I sat there for three days in the back of the mosque, looking and observing and watching people pray. And then I asked Shafiq, can you teach me to pray like a Muslim? And he taught me the first surah of the Quran, Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alamin. Ah, uh, it was such a blessing. I was memorizing only sounds, but then I would look and I would try to figure out what each sound meant, what each word meant. And as I studied it, I saw Ar-Rahman Erohim, grace and mercy, forgiveness of sins. Wow. My life was transformed immediately. It was the love of God and the love of the Muslims around me that drew me to Islam. Excellent. And I received a card that I was an official Muslim. <laughs> I got in the car and went to Mecca immediately. Wow. And when I saw the Kaaba for the first time and fell on my knees and my face in prayer, it was there that I was just filled with God's spirit and and understood the love of Islam, the mercy of Islam for people everywhere. SubhanAllah. And when, when you did uh, go into Mecca and you went into the Kaaba, uh, you mentioned your feelings when you saw the Kaaba itself, but what were your feelings like when you saw people stand for prayer, like thousands of people coming together and following instructions like that? Well, it was, it was uh, in, invigorating. It was, uh, I was enthused. In my faith, I was confirmed in my faith by prayer at that time. And uh, it was the first time for me to kneel and pray with other Muslims. Uh, it was a great experience. And uh, Christians need to understand what is truly Islam. I was totally misled by what I saw in news reports in the West before I came to Saudi Arabia. But when I hear the Quran recited, it's, uh, it's miraculous. It's transforming. And I'm very grateful now to be a part of a, of a historic faith that is known for its mercy and not its violence, which is mischaracterized by Western media. Of course, of course. The first Ramadan was difficult for me, 30 days, from sunrise to sunset, no food, no water. I hadn't, my body went through a period of shock, but the next year was easier, the next year was much easier, and now I look forward to Ramadan when I can you know, fast and worship God in this very important way.